My name is David Munoz Sarabia and welcome to my YouTube channel. So it's been on my mind for many of years to create a YouTube channel and create a platform that would bring people together and talk about the deep and raw stuff. So I firmly believe in people's stories. They tell us what a person has gone through and made them them. Stories also provide the opportunity for people to listen to what they have to say and help someone who may need it. If I can share my experiences about the things I've gone through to help someone else, I'm going to do that. So what are some things that you may see on my channel? You will definitely see content that is just me and you. So me talking to a camera, or in this case, my phone. I will be talking to you about certain issues. Sometimes we won't agree or may have a different opinion and that's totally okay. A roommate of mine, his name is William, or ex-roommate I should say, uh, told me I had such a willingness to want to hear other people's perspectives. The reasoning behind that is there are many different ways of seeing things. And it's never okay to, to be closed-minded at all. Being open to new ideas is fun and exciting. And I want to share my experiences to help y'all out. People that know me know that I am involved. High school was an era. People that knew me knew that I would join clubs and I would run them. And people knew me because of clubs. And thanks to the many opportunities that I had and currently hold, I want to share my experiences, tips, and provide information that can help you become a better leader. Everyone has the potential to lead and make a difference, and I want to help with that. So I am now in my second year. I just finished my first year. Boom. And um, I go to the University of North Texas, UNT, Wyoming Green, and a junior credit wise. I am a first generation college student, and I have tools and resources to make the transition from high school to college or a big university smoother. Because college is not easy. Being the first, you have a lot of expectations and the pressure of making sure you're um, on top of it making sure you have the grades, making sure that um, just so many factors and kind of expectation that's put on your shoulders and it could be a lot for some of y'all. I know it's for me, but um, I want to kind of help alleviate that because at the end of the day, making sure that you did your best is what matters. Making sure that you're enjoying the things you're doing, making sure that um, you're enjoying that experience is what matters. But even though I'm in college, that also means I've been in high school. So if you're in high school, this is for y'all. I could definitely help with surviving the drama, the BS, and other pressures that life throws at you. High school is a period of just hormones and a lot of insecurities. And a lot of people can be mean. And because they're not okay with themselves or there's things that are going at home that make them act a certain way. And even though you're going through things, I personally believe that you shouldn't lash out at other people, people that care about you. And because you, it's, it's a bad day. There's no excuse to treat someone badly. So if if I could be kind of a, a person that can help with any of that, I want to do that. So I'm here for y'all. And lastly, I want to have a round table of different people and have the conversation about the stuff that you may want to talk about. Or it's kind of like, uh-oh, like, I don't know, maybe this is not my place. Or it's just really sensitive and very kind of what's the word divisive not divisive but kind of it stirs a lot of um, arguments or you know the word I'm talking about and I want to have it where it's run by us young folks I think keeping conversation honest and real 
will definitely help people. It will make an impact. It will uh, really get the get something moving. Get cause um, a movement to happen. Cause to, for change to actually stir up because people are talking about the issues that affect us. And a lot of it could be climate change. A lot of things could be other um, a wage gap. Um, other things that people are just kind of sick and tired of. Healthcare. I know that it doesn't have to be all political. It could be pop culture, about just different things. But those are just some examples that came up in my head. And this was kind of behind the shows The Real or The View. It's something that I really want to have with my friends, different people, different uh, perspectives and different takes on it. It's a work in progress. So don't come at me yet. It's, we're working on it. And that's what I have in store for y'all. If you think we should add more things or just talk about certain, certain topics, please leave a comment below. This is something new and I hope that I can edit videos and provide content that will help y'all and make a meaningful impact. Talk about certain things with honesty, and realness. And I always wanted to do this. Make sure you like, you click the like button and subscribe. Uh, you know, you know when you always see YouTubers and you always say the same thing at the very end. Now I get to say it, booyah. But I'm David and that's a wrap. See y'all next time.